Hey guys, hey guys, my name is Lola and welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is the first time I'm talking about I love you. If this is the second time, either way, I still love you. So, today I'm going to be doing a very easy, everyday glam, which is going to be like glamorous, but not too much colors or anything in particular. So, without further ado, let's jump to the video. But before we do that, make sure to smash that subscribe button right over here. I'm sure it's here or here, wherever it is, just make sure to hit it and Press that bell button so that anytime I upload a video, you'll be the first to be notified. So without further ado, let's jump into the video. Stop the first I'm going to start with this my Pons Vanishing Primer to prime my face. This is a mattifying primer because right now in Lagos it's very hot. So what you want to do is use a mattifying primer, not a moisturizing primer, because I feel a moisture a mattifying primer now will help hold the makeup and make it last longer. So now I'm just massaging that into my face. Next then I'm going to go in with my Maybelline foundation in the shade in the shade Mocha. So I'm just going to put two pumps of that at the back of my hand and use my finger to first press it all over my face. Then next one I'll go with a beauty blender later on to blend everything into my skin. I'm just putting that all over so next on I'll go with this my beauty blender to blend everything into my face you know to keep the pigmentation so blending 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 so what I'm going to do now is blend the foundation into my neck because trust me we don't want the neck to be different from the face So next one, I'm going with my Pro Concealer in front, LA Pro Concealer in front, to highlight the center of my face. The center of my face. Next, I just did that on my chin, the bridge of my nose and my forehead. Next, again, with that same beauty blend that I used at the beginning of that foundation, that is to blend foundation to also blend my concealer into my skin. This beauty blender is not damp because I don't want the concealer to, you know, move. The next one, I'm going in with my Benign Luxury Powder in Clay 5 to set underneath my eye and all the areas I highlighted with the boot, the down part of my beauty blender. So I'm just dipping that, dipping that, dipping that, dipping that, dipping that, dipping, dipping, dipping. And... Pounce, pounce, pounce. So I'm going to apply that also on my chin, the ridge of my nose. I'm not I'm not putting down my forehead because trust me guys right now it's very hot in Lagos so I don't want to like make my forehead look messy. I'm just laying that powder again. So now I'm just using this powder brush to dust off the excess powder off my face, the powder on my chin. I'm just dusting them off. I don't know how I'm dancing. No. I don't. So next one I'm just going in with this my for me only powder kit. I'm just using this last deep shade here to contour my face with this my vinyl contour brush i don't know the name of the brush <laughs> so i'm just going to contour my face with that so i just did the side of my forehead i'm back to my cheeks again so now i'm just contouring my nose with that same powder contour. So now I'm going with this my Beauty Beyond to bronze up my face, like you know, just to make my face look more warm and more, more snatched with the same brush I used to contour. I'm just using my early pro concealer in Toffee to, you know, 
prime my eyelid to give my eyeshadow a base this way it helps my eyeshadow have something to stick to on my eyelid so now i'm just using this beauty blender to blend the concealer into my eyelid To go in with my box of crayon eyeshadow palette and I'm going to go in in the shade brown and tan mixed together with this my vinyl brush so after dusting of the excess I start by applying that all over my crease this color build up lightly like I'm trying to build the color so that it's not be harsh or patchy so now you can see the color is coming off and um, by the way guys this eyeshadow is very pig very pigmented so I'm taking this to my outer V I'm very going to place that on my outer outer V outer Next on, I'm going with this shade called Deep Plump with that same brush and apply that over my lid also. What you want to do is take your time to blend out the eyeshadow. So next on, I'm going with this my black random eyeliner pencil to line my eyes so that there will not be gap between my eye lashes and my eyeshadow next i'm going with this brown shade again to do my lower lash line to just smoke it out that brown shade again with that same brush to still smoke it out again so now I'm going with that eyeliner again to do my waterline it's just a random eyeliner the name has washed off it's so uh, I can't remember the name sorry guys <laughs> So now I'm going in my Megani blush with this my vinyl brush to blush up my cheeks. By the way, this blush is pretty cheap. It's just 500 naira. So in case you're interested, get it from your from your local wherever. Shall just get. Going in with this my Kiss Beauty Glow Highlight and this my fan brush to glow up my face. I mean the high cheek, the eye point of my face. So this is where the magic happens. This is like my favorite part, part of makeup. Freaking good, so I'm just putting down my brow bone, my cheeks, and above my brow, the tip of my nose, and my and my cupid's bow. Next on, I'm going with this my black opal mascara, so you know. <sighs> apply that on my lashes before I go into a palai to put on my false lashes so I'm just using that to lift my lashes upwards upwards so that's that about that thanks to blessing for dashing me this 
mascara because this mascara is so bomb like when next i go to the market i'm going to get this so now i'm just applying my lashes and just you know holding it together make sure it's firm and it sticks to my original lashes my ocean setting spray to set the whole of my face you know so that this makeup will last all day it can be waterproof sunproof sweat proof and even bullet proof <laughs> so next on for the lips i'm going with this my mac lip liner and this mac glossy lips in bubble gum i guess that's the name so i'm using this mo7 to line my lips So now I'm just doing my upper lips and getting about my business, going about my business, just lining my lips. So now I just smudged my lips together so that the lip liner would look, you know, natural with my lip color. So next on, I'm just going to go with that. MAC lip gloss in bubble gum to apply that all over my lips like guys I can't lie this gloss is everything it has like so guys yes this is a finished look like this looks really really bomb like gloss you're I'm shooting this with my phone so kisses to all you are watching Smash it, smash it, smash it, okay, smash it, smash it, smash it, smash it, okay, I'm getting too crazy, okay, better go, better go, stop, stop, stop. <laughs>